Ladies and gentlemen, we are officially open for business. Let's go. Go and they get results without being actually tested. So my call to Ugandan is to be vigilant, uh, to check and see that the place you're seeking health care services from carries a license, and these licenses are required by law to be displayed so that you can get a license. Both the health workers are licensed as well as the premises have to be licensed. So if you suspect as a, a, a keen Ugandan that you're having a, uh, a quark laboratory, I would advise you to straight away call the health monitoring unit. We have a toll-free number uh, which I'm going to give to you. Call and then we shall be able to or uh, liaise with partners like the NDA, the councils, to come in and check that out. And if it's indeed uh, not licensed, then it will have to be closed. Why, why Uganda? I think that's the question. Why Supreme Laboratories? Am I understanding correctly? Okay. Um, AID Genomics has always wanted to expand into Africa. And for the past, we've been looking to identify countries where we could bring a true benefit. And for us, we found Uganda. And we're planning on making Uganda our headquarters and starting point for the entire of Africa. I think what we bring to Uganda that's very unique in this laboratory is we bring is innovative Israeli technology. And we believe in Israel that we want to make testing and healthcare as affordable to as many people as possible. And the way to do that is through innovative technology. When you have good technology, you're able to reduce costs. And what we bring here in Supreme Laboratories, it's besides the cost, we keep the quality, but we have very, very good technology. And by doing that, we plan to expand all over Uganda and all over Africa. And this is our starting point. I want to thank the government of Israel through AIDS Genomics and Genus Heroes for having accepted to come and partner with us so that we provide this service. We bring services nearer to the people. I know of people who have had to travel to US, to UK, to India, to Hong Kong, wherever, looking for a laboratory to diagnose them so that they can get quality results, which quality results can be used by doctors to diagnose the disease and then prescribe the right medicine. We now have it in Uganda. We have it here in Kabalagala, in Makindia district, in Makindia subdivision, in Kampala district. So we are very thankful for this mileage that we have brought in the industry.